Hi, um, my name is Natalie Barbu and I am addicted to bathing suits. Okay, hey everyone, so now that I have admitted my problem, that is the first step in recovery. So now I'm just going to be showing you guys a swimsuit collection of mine and I thought I was the perfect person to do this swimsuit collection video because I probably have the most bathing suits out of every single person that I know. I have so many bathing suits, you guys. Like, I really do have a problem. I didn't even realize how many bathing suits I had until I started pulling them out of my drawer in order to film this video. And I realized, yeah, I definitely have a problem. I am going to kind of do this video. Um, first, I'm gonna show you bathing suits that I have as a pair. So normally, most of my bathing suits are not matchy-matchy. Like, I just kind of mix and match tops and bottoms. So first, I'm just going to show you the bathing suits that I do have a top and a bottom for. And then I'm just going to show you bathing suits that are kind of all mix and match. So I'm just going to jump right in because I do have a lot of bathing suits. So the first thing I'm going to start out with is going to be my one piece and I only have one one piece and the reason I bought this one piece is because I needed it for a church camp that I was going to. Um, it was in Panama City Beach and it was with my church and since it was like a church camp we weren't allowed to wear two pieces so I had to buy a one piece for the trip. It looks like this, it's like bubblegum pink and the sleeves are super thick and then it has like this like cute in the middle and it's just a one piece so next bathing suit is a two piece and this is from American Eagle this was during my stage where I was working at American Eagle and I bought everything in sight so I got this bathing suit it's purple and then it has three straps in the back which is really cool and then the bottoms are just purple and they have that like pinkish orange color at the top so it matches Next bathing suit is actually my oldest bathing suit that I own. I got this I think in like seventh grade and if you guys don't know, I am pretty flat chested. I am not very curvy at all, just gonna put it that way. So this is a little bit small on me now, but honestly it's not even that small on me. Um, I In seventh grade it was like, whoa, it has padding in it. Like <laughs> I was like, but anyways, um, most of you guys probably have this bathing suit because literally everyone I knew had it. It's from Abercrombie and it's just the navy blue striped bathing suit and I have the bottoms to go with it. I think the bottoms are all like, as you, I don't know if you can see, but they're all like been through the washing machine. It's had its good run. I don't really wear this bathing suit anymore, but I have it because it does fit me still, so why would I give it away? But yeah, so most of you guys probably have this. Comment down below if you guys have this bathing suit or remember this bathing suit. Next bathing suit I have is from Gilly Hicks, and it is, Gilly Hicks is actually like the same brand as Abercrombie and Hollister, but it's not as known, and it's just a coral bathing suit, it's triangle, it has crochet detailing on these sides, so it's just a plain triangle bikini, and then the bottoms are just plain bottoms with the Gilly Hicks logo on the side. Next one is another popular one that you probably remember from middle school, maybe freshman year of high school, depending how old you are, obviously. Um, it's also from Abercrombie, I think, yeah. And it is this, like, kind of tie-dye pink one, and it's triangle. I thought it was really cute. This one definitely still fits me, because it's a little bit bigger than the other one. Um, and then, again, just the tie-dye pink bottoms. Next bathing suit I got this summer, and it is another triangle one, but this one is really cute. I really like it because I like the color because you don't see most bathing suits in this color since most bathing suits are like bright colors. It's just a maroon bathing suit from Target, and it's like really like cinched up. I don't know why, but I'm, I'm not that small, but... <laughs> and then it just has square cutouts on the side and a turquoise bead in the middle. And then I got the bottoms with it, which are just plain maroon bottoms. Next bathing suit is also from Target, and I know that they sold it in stores this year, but I got it last year. It is my American um, flag one. So the bottoms look like this, and these bottoms are actually huge on me. They're size medium, which I know it's like huge. So it's reversible. It's red stripes on this side, and then American flag stars on this side. So you can wear this one, the stripes if it's not 4th of July, and then the stars if it is 4th of July. My next bathing suit is my all-time favorite bathing suit, and it is the brand Triangle, which many of you have probably heard of, because Triangle is actually pretty big. Um, a lot of celebrities have it, and I've just seen it on a lot of Instagram and YouTube people's posts. The bottoms look like this, and they're like, um, 
I don't know what the material is called, but it's kind of like scuba material, like when you go scuba, scuba diving. So it's just plain like turquoise or mint green or whatever. I think this was called Miami Mint. I think that's the color. And then black around the edges. So something so simple can be so cute. And then the top, it has no padding in it. So I thought, okay, that's really weird, but it's actually like really cute. And it kind of like makes you look more curvy, if you know what I mean. But yeah, this is my favorite bathing suit, not only for the fact that it kind of adds some curves on you, but just because it is really cute and it is so flattering. This next bathing suit is also from American Eagle. Actually, it's from Aerie, but same thing. It is just pink crochet, just hot pink crochet triangle, and then hot pink crochet bottom. This next one, I put it together as a pair, but it's actually from two different stores, but I wear these a lot together. I wore it actually yesterday. The top is from Target, and it's just um, like aqua turquoise, and it has the gold chains in the middle with kind of like um, braided, um, kind of like a braided bracelet, but just like in the middle of it, and it's super cute. It's just a bandeau. And then the bottoms I got from Victoria's Secret, and they're hot pink, and have kind of like the same braided materials right here. I'm actually really upset though because the very first day I wear it, this broke off. So like it's really annoying when I wear it, but I still love it. And this is probably my favorite bottoms that I own because I love the sides of it. And I think they look really cute together. This is probably like my all-time favorite bathing suit. I just got it this month. I bought it online at the Victoria's Secret like bathing suit sale. Um, it's this top. So it's kind of crochet, like lacy material with a lot of pastel flowers and pastel colors on it. It has padding, but it does not have any push-up. So I really like it. Actually, like if I had push-up, I wouldn't mind, but <laughs> I still really like it. And the bottoms are so cute. They're the same um, material, and they're just roughly around the edges. And there is a string bathing suit. So yeah, that's just what it looks like. This looks so good on. It makes you look so tan. I love this bathing suit. This next bathing suit I bought this year in Mexico when I went, and it is from the store Zingara. It's a Mexican brand store, but I know they have it some places in the US. So the top is just neon green, neon yellow, whatever you call this color. And then the middle of it, it has like a little slit in the middle. And then it has all these cool jewels and blue and pink beading on it. The bottoms are kind of like really, really cheeky. They're like the Brazilian bottoms. So they don't cover much, but yeah, that's what the back looks like. And that is what the front looks like. But the sides are so cute. It has the same beading that the slit had. This next bathing suit, I also got an American Eagle, like many of my bathing suits. And it is just... A lot of like different greens, blues, purple colors at the bottom with some neon yellow string and then the fringe, ah, sorry guys, the fringe top that I have. And then this one used to be my mom's bathing suit and she just passed it down to me so the bottoms are a little big on me but it still fits and then the top is super cute. It's white, it doesn't have padding so like you can't really get wet in it because kind of see-through but it's white without padding and it has a giant stone blue heart and then this pattern on the back and on the tie of it and then the bottoms are the same color as the pattern or is the same pattern as the pattern and it's just these blue and brown and white hearts and spades or whatever it is I don't even know okay guys so you thought that was it right no 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 no, no. I have like double that now in just the ones that I mix and match so I'm just gonna kinda put them out randomly and then I literally mix and match any of these even if they don't really match. So let's start with this one. So this is a just hot pink bandeau that I have. Actually, I did not purchase this. My best friend Alden gave it to me because she outgrew these and so of course they fit me. <laughs> For example, you can wear it with these bottoms that you can also wear with a bunch of other tops. It's just this, um, I don't really know where this is from. It's stripes and it just has a ton of colors and it has a belt which I think is really cool. Next bottoms are these from Target that I love and these are red and yellow and have a tribal print and you can wear them with so many different colors and they are very flattering. This next one still has the tag on it and I'm pretty sure I got it last year. I honestly have no idea how to wear this. Um, keep in mind though, my little sister got this and just put it in my drawer so I technically didn't buy it. I don't know if it's a one shoulder or if it's something like this. I honestly have no clue how to wear this. This next bathing suit bottom, I'll be honest with you, I really don't know why I bought it. Actually, I do know why. It was $4, so I was like, 
hey, why not? And I regret it because I really don't wear it. It's from Target. It's I Actually, it does fit me, but it's just purple and white, and I barely ever wear it. Next top is also one that my best friend Alden gave me. So this one is a black just crochet top, and then it has the little, like, different layer right there so I did not pay for this my friend Alden gave it to me next bottoms I as you guys can tell I have a lot of striped bottoms but it's another striped one it's from Target it has purple blue orange a bunch of colors that you can wear with a bunch of colored tops this next top that I got is also from Target and it is a push-up but it's not really a push-up it has a giant bow on it I love this bathing suit so much I think it's so cute so it's just a giant bow this next bathing suit is from American Eagle and it is actually a push-up bathing suit and it kind of looks like a bra I don't know and then it has the halter on it next bottoms are these Roxy bottoms and again my little sister bought these I didn't but she put them in my drawer they are black and just have Roxy all over them this next top is from Victoria's Secret and I have barely ever worn this top I just thought it was kind of cool I don't really know why I bought it again these are like years old but it is a bunch of different layers and then it has a little confetti so I feel like I look kind of like a clown in it. This next top is from American Eagle and it kind of basically is a strapless bra. Like it looks like a strapless bra. This next one is from Victoria's Secret. I got this a couple years ago and it was my very first push-up bathing suit. So it is this blue with black flowers on it and this was seriously like revolutionary when I got it and it has just the striped black strap. Next bathing suit is this one that's one of my favorites actually. It's from Target and it has, again, that little fabric layer. I don't know, that's really in right now, this like piece. And it's just kind of like a peach salmon color. And it's just a bandeau. This next bottom is just solid color blue from Victoria's Secret. Next one, my friend Alden gave it to me. Again, she gave me quite a few of them. It's kind of a push up Victoria's Secret one. It's not really that big of a push-up, but it's a little bit, and it's purple, and it has a halter. My next one is from Gilly Hicks again, or my second one from Gilly Hicks. It is just a white bandeau with little eyelet material, eyelet flower things. This one is from Victoria's Secret, and it is just this, I don't even know what this print is called. It's main color is black and just has a bunch of different flowers and leaves on it in all different colors. This next one is also from Victoria's Secret and it is just plain blue. This next one is like the very first one that I showed you and it is just plain purple with the little tie and my friend Alden gave this one to me as well. This next one I got this summer. It is from Topshop at the mall. It is just like, it's basically like that other bandeau one that I showed you with the fabric thing and it's kind of like a salmon peach color and it has a tie and I really like it because of the little triangle in the middle I think it's very very cute this one is also like the purple one that I just showed you and the very first one that I showed you except it is striped so it's multicolored and again my best friend Alden gave this one to me next one is one of my favorites it's from Abercrombie I think let me see yeah, Abercrombie and Fitch, and it again is like one of those with the extra fabric and little layer of it, so it kind of looks like a really, really crop top. This next one is from Victoria's Secret, and it is a bandeau, and you just tie it in the middle, and it's green, and it reminds me of a watermelon. This one is just a plain white bikini bottom. I love this one just because I feel like every single girl needs a black and white bikini bottom just to wear with anything. And of course, since I mentioned every girl needs a white and black one, here is my black one. And it's a different um, shape. I just got this one this year and at the semi-annual sale. It is also like Brazilian. It's like really cheeky. It's black and this is the front and this is the back. So it is does not cover that much skin, but it's definitely not like a thong. My next one I actually do have bottoms to, but I have absolutely no idea where they are, so I probably should find them. Uh, is this one from Victoria's Secret. It is lace neon green, and underneath the lace is purple, or I don't know if it's lace, but it's more like lacrosse penny material. Next one is this bandeau from Victoria's Secret, and it has a star in the middle, so I think it's so cute, and it's just plain white. And I bought this with some navy blue bottoms, and I don't know where those are either. And last but not least, I have a tankini, also for the same reason that I have a one piece. So I got this tankini, so it is from Old Navy. It's purple, it has kind of like a bandeau thing at the top and then just fabric at the bottom and it has a gold little I don't know what it's called little 
barrette thing, I don't know, in it, just to give it kind of an accent, and it is a halter top. So, that was my swimsuit collection. Wow, that was a lot, like, Oh my gosh, I'm actually pretty embarrassed to show you guys this. Just let me know what your favorite bathing suit was, what bathing suits you guys have. Um, send me links of your videos of swimsuit collections. And make sure you thumbs this video up, because that helps me a ton. So thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up if you liked this video, and if you don't, thumbs it up too. <laughs> um, so anyways, yeah, thank you so much. Make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter, just to keep up with my daily life. And I hope that you guys have an awesome summer. I'm going to be doing a back-to-school giveaway before the summer ends and before I move to my dorm room. So keep in mind for that one, it'll just be something small or maybe something big depending on how I'm feeling. So I hope that you guys have an awesome day and I will talk to you guys later. Bye!